y'all it is your girl angel and welcome back to angel's life yeah 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 i have the same thing on in the last video y'all already know what it is i'm recording my second video in the same day so without further ado let's get straight into it okay because since i am officially 38 weeks we can talk about week 37 did y'all hear me say that? Did y'all hear me say I was 38 weeks? I know I said I was 38 weeks in the last video. But let me tell y'all again, I'm 38 weeks. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> y'all don't understand. I'm so motherfucking tired of being pregnant. Y'all, I can't even, like, <laughs> I can't even explain how tired of being pregnant I am. So the thought that I am 38 weeks and typically the goal is to get to 40 girl girl 38 sounds like heaven okay because let me tell you something 37 dragged i know i said that in the last video but let me put a little bit more emphasis on it sis she dragged she dragged she dragged she dragged she dragged conned okay and i am just over it i'm glad she's she's just gone <laughs> so um so yeah week 37 just was it was like playing the waiting game because at um at Yakota you don't have a doctor's appointment at week 37 I know usually if I was like stateside seeing a regular OB I think weeks 36 7 8 9 and 40 you would be seeing your doctor weekly at this point but at Yakota, you don't. And I feel like because this is like the week where nothing is happening, nothing really happened. Nothing new really happened. I still have heartburn. I ended the week at the same weight. Excuse me. I ended the week at the same weight from week 36. I'm still 135. Um... I mean, 145, excuse me. It's, I've gained 35 pounds, and I still am 145. I think maybe I'm like 145.5, so that's it. Um, What else? I still have heartburn. I'm still gassy. Y'all still hear me belching? Um, <laughs> like, nothing new happened. My baby is still moving. Like, he is Bruce Lee. Um, you know... <laughs> Um, just nothing happened besides me nesting. So pretty much I've just been sleeping and cleaning. Either I'm sleeping or I'm cleaning. Because when I'm up, I feel like I need to be cleaning. I need to be getting stuff done because my baby will be here any day now. So when I'm up, I'm cleaning. And when I'm not cleaning, I'm tired. Or even when I am cleaning, I'm still tired. But I just feel obligated to clean so that's pretty much all i've been doing um we know that darius's birthday is next week so i did um spend a day or two out making sure i had things prepared for his birthday but that's pretty much it you guys i wish it was something more exciting but it wasn't hasn't been He's not here yet. I'm still pregnant. <laughs> um, so yeah. Just nothing. Emotionally, I've just I'm exhausted. I am exhausted. Um, because I'm just tired of being pregnant. I am just fucking tired of being pregnant. 37 was a drag emotionally and physically and mentally because just straight the fuck up by this time you are just tired of being pregnant the one thing and excuse me there was one thing that has intensified and that is one I literally pee all the time like I was peeing a lot before but ladies and gentlemen like Y'all, I piss all the time. Like, 
all the time. Like, I could take a sip. I could swallow my own saliva and have to pee. Like, oop, I got, I got pee now. And it kind of hurts to walk now. Like, now my waddle is like Penguin City waddle. Like, I'm like, I got the... I got the wobble waddle waddle <laughs> because I feel so much pressure on like my pelvis. It's like I cannot help it. I like I am like waddle city and I cannot, 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 cannot help it. It is so much pressure. It's literally like he's falling out of me that's how it feels if i could compare it to anything it's like he's just drifting down and down and down which i know is a good thing that's what we want him to do we want him to drift down but it's just so much fucking pressure on my pelvis and it is so uncomfortable it is so uncomfortable like oh god it is so uncomfortable I cannot put enough emphasis on it. And this is something that I had felt on and off before for like the past couple weeks. Now, I can honestly say it's consistent. It doesn't matter if I'm standing. It doesn't matter if I'm sitting. It doesn't matter if I'm laying. It does not matter what I'm doing. I am constantly feeling that pressure on my pelvis bone. And it it is just so uncomfortable. I'm not going to say it hurts. I'm not going to say it's like painful because it's not necessarily painful but it is just uncomfortable it is just uncomfortable it's like somebody i mean it it, it feels like exactly what it is somebody is like laying sitting or just on your goddamn pelvis bone it's like a weight it's like literally somebody dropped the goddamn weight on your pelvis bone and it is just it's uncomfortable no matter what you do so what can you do? You know, it is what it is. But yes, besides that, nothing really, nothing really too crazy, nothing really too new. Just playing the wait in game at this point and just ready, just ready for whatever to happen, to happen, you know? Um, yeah. That's pretty much all I got for y'all. Of course, I'm going to go ahead and get up, give y'all this bump shot, which, as far as I'm concerned, it's not that, um, it's not that different from last week. Because <laughs> I feel like I, I feel like he's still growing, but I've stopped growing, if that makes sense. And I guess that, like, I've been reading that that apparently does happen. Like, there's a point where you will kind of stop growing, but he's still growing. And I think maybe I'm at this, at that point. I have also been cramping, like... Especially at night, around the time that I'm going to sleep, it feels like period cramps. If it, like, it literally feels like my period is coming down. And I've been feeling that for like the last two or three days. So, I don't know if that's a sign of something. If any of you moms out there who've already had a baby, if you're on your second or you just had a baby or you know what that means, please tell me. Because I don't know. It's like, is that normal to like feel like? Because for the past two or three days, I've literally been cramping at night for maybe 30 or 40 minutes just feeling like my period is about to come down i haven't had the bloody show yet no mucus i have had discharge but that's regular but nothing out of the ordinary so i don't know if i don't know if what that means i don't know like i don't know y'all let me know if that's new or not <laughs> um yeah and also i told y'all in the not the last video, but like the video before that, that I did plan on getting my membrane swept. So, y'all, let me still let me know what y'all think about that. And yeah, because I'm, I'm a couple days away now, so I need to know what y'all think. The fuck? <laughs> but let me go ahead, back it on up, show y'all. Turn to the side because I look I look I look small from right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull her up. Oh so this is my 37 week pregnancy bump. And then we're gonna turn to the front. Okay. Y'all see my life.
like lying. She all crooked and shit. She like doing the squigglies. <laughs> um, I'm ashy right now, but usually I am like coconut oiled down. Okay, because we're trying to avoid having stretch marks. But yeah. That is the bump shot. Okay. Oof. Oof. You move slower, girl. Let me tell you something. Especially when you get around this point. When you got pressure in your pelvis and and just things is just not going right. You got like and I started, I've been having back pains every single night i had back pain every single night in week 37 thank you shout out to my husband shout out to you darius because let me tell you something he's a lazy ass nigga <laughs> straight the fuck up there's no other way to say it but i've been having back pains every night and he has rubbed my back every night i'm not gonna say he's done a great job but i appreciate the fact that he's even done it Okay, because it has been hurting and he has been, he's been trying to be as attentive as he can to me. And I appreciate you. I love you. If you are watching this, babe, I love you. Thank you for rubbing my back every night. Okay, because I'm going to need you to rub it tonight because my shit is hurting right now. <laughs> so, um, shout out to you, Stanky. But yeah, that's all I got, you guys. I love y'all so much. I potentially cannot wait to see y'all in the next video um i'm saying that because the next video would essentially be my third actually no the next video will not so i can't wait to see y'all in the next video <laughs> i cannot wait to see y'all in the next video make sure y'all go follow me on instagram at angels life make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel also go check out my goddamn website it's www.angelslife.com where i dig into a little while I dig into some other shit or the same shit or whatever. Or just check it out because you support me or whatever. Who knows? Whatever. <laughs> but I love y'all so much. Again, I can't wait to see y'all in the next video. And I'm out. Peace.